pinstriping is different and I say more than a more different than typical art forms because there's never been any kind of formal training for pinstriping and hand lettering or as to any other art form in the world you can go to school for so for a long time I was just figuring out traveling all over the country in a van to all these like legendary pinstripers shops asking questions and things like that and when you're on the road driving across country you experience things that like most people never will like even state to state how different culturally it is like you could drive to Arizona from here and it's so much different than California and then when you get to New Mexico or Colorado it's totally different so I think that Finding like inspiration through signs, like art and lettering, just like the cultural differences. I don't know, that, I can't, that stuff's always like intrigued me. Deep down, everybody wants to be happy. Every neighborhood, every small community, every big city, everybody wants to get along and be happy. And I think, I think nowadays, like, it's harder because a lot of people like, you know, you have the internet now and social media. So it's like the instant gratification that people, you know, they see somebody's life be better or whatever. And and they want that and they want that now. And, and it, it takes time. Rome wasn't built in a day. So I think that a lot of people could learn a lot from traveling. I, I think that I've realized that happiness can come very simple if you, you know, if you realize that, you know, you're not stuck in one place and you're not stuck in one situation. You can, like, you can build your dreams if you really want. The American dream but totally is out there. But you just, you gotta, you know, patience is huge. And then, like, just, you know, I guess perseverance. And I always say, if you want, for any artist, not just pinstriping, but if you want a good indication of an artist's style, look at their life. <laughs> because they're gonna, they're gonna, ex any artist is gonna express, like, their life through their art. And mine's, like, very clean, and then it's, like, abstract at the end. So it's, like, that's my life. Very organized, and it's, like, a, organized chaos in my life, so that's how my work looks.